what I'm about to tell you could save your life. There are a few things in life that will remind any human, no matter how powerful and stoic, that they are but mere mortals. And those are biting into a frozen starburst and facing down a tank. Now, there's nothing I can really say to help you with the former. That is just a baseline, horrible thing for a human to experience. But the tank thing, that, that I know something about. See, if you are like I was, then you probably think to yourself that, man, if it was just me there standing in a field, me versus a tank, I, I'd probably lose. I'd probably be toast. I mean, it's just gonna look down and blast me and I'd be gone. Au contraire, be not afraid, because between mankind and a tank, man is the superior weapon. I'm about to show you the ultimate guide to single-handedly taking down any kind of tank that comes rolling up on your lawn. All tanks really should be afraid that this video even exists on the internet. It is a restricted World War II training video, all about how to crack that tank. Dude, this opener is a banger! Look at that. Do you think you could take that down? Those tanks look kind of tough, don't they? I guess you think you wouldn't have much of a chance up against those babies. But don't get the idea you can't handle those blitz buggies just because they're big and they make a lot of noise. Actually, you guys got the edge on them if you know how to play your cards. I gotta pause the video real quick and just say this guy's confidence and charisma is just bonkers. This man has already sold me that tanks are nothing more than cracking an egg. And dang it, he's gonna show us how to do just that. We haven't even gotten into the thick of it yet, boys. Now, this is about the way the job lines up. You knock out as many tanks as you can, and at the same time, protect yourself so you can mow down that enemy infantry. Tanks got weak points like anything else. The track is one of them. A mine, or a shell... A classic move, a lucky shooting out the tires. Blast off it the works track. for tanks, too. Now, here's another weak point. We don't see too good out of these rolling pillboxes. Here's what a tanker sees when he bears down on you. If you're the kind of foot troops you ought to be, that's what he sees. Absolutely nothing. Just a lot of real estate. It's free real estate. You're there, all right. But you're tucked away in a foxhole. He can't see you. He can't get at you. Oh no, get out of there, Ricky! Hell, they can't even hurt you when No! Look at that, he's clear, he's good! Tank didn't even know he was there. Of course, there's one way you can get in trouble. That's if you get yourself in a lather and start to hightail it. No! And Ricky, that's don't run! Those Nazi guns don't run, it's no for. use! Take a look no, at Ricky! No! Oh, it's a massacre! This is just like Bambi! During that scene that traumatized me as a child where they're all like, the birds are hiding in the weeds and they're like, Don't fly! Don't fly! Man is coming! Except instead of man, it's a massive rolling ton of metal that'll just blow you in half. Rest in peace, Ricky. You were a good man. Except you were a coward. So you died. Now remember that picture when you get itchy feet. Make a break for it and you're a dead duck. But remember, you're playing on a big team, soldier. Give it about enough. That's the idea. See, look at him. See him that's the. In? That's the guy that killed Mickey. You. Oh, go. you better run. Wait a minute, soldier. Keep that rifle up there. See these things? Those are what he looks through. The periscope and the vision slits. Get enough small stuff bearing on those places, and you blind them almost a hundred percent. And if you're a okay. real epic gamer, you can do the job. 360 no scope the right there in their fox drive. Just blast them. Now these rifle grenades are nasty damn things. As far as a tanker is concerned, they just plain stink. I'd rather be in a straitjacket with a wildcat than be inside the box with those things coming at me. They bore through and splash hot metal all over the place. Ooh! And they'll do that That's to right. any damn tank they with dreamed hot up so sauce. far. Thought that guy was a goner, didn't you? 
He wasn't worried. I had my doubts. He knew he had a good foxhole, but he's mad now. See what he's got there? He's a got booze. He's like gonna drink rag. his sorrows the away. Sword busts on top of the tank. Even and better, he's get. going the path of the pyromaniac. A little piece of hell on the outside, and on the inside, a lot of barbecued hides. You see, the burning gas pours through cracks and crevices in the tank. Nine times out of ten, it'll find oil or grease or more gas inside. And if it does, well, do you want to take a look inside? Nope, 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 I, I believe you. I, yeah, no, I believe you. You can't stop a tank with your bare chest no matter how much hair you got on it. Bet. It takes good common sense, and it takes guts. The one thing not to do is to run. Because if you do, brother, I'm telling you, you're a dead duck. This guy's got a really strange obsession with ducks. I mean, he's a great teacher, but everything's a duck. We got live ducks, sitting ducks, dead ducks, j every kind of duck he can assemble. They're all here. And last of all, get this. A battlefield is a hell of a big place, and you can't see the whole thing. Maybe all you'll see are the guys right around you. Riflemen, just like you. Don't get the idea that you're out there all alone, fighting this war by yourself. You got a lot of stuff pitching for you. Big stuff. Just because you're playing the line and can't see the backfield doesn't mean it isn't there. It's there, brother. And it's fighting for you all the time. You do your job. Take it from me, the rest of us are gonna do ours. The more of us out there who know how to stop a charging tank with nothing but a BB gun and a Molotov cocktail, the better. Heck, with this guy's confidence, he could convince me that you could take down a tank with a squirt gun. I hope he does all of these, because there are more training videos, and we will be watching them. If you don't mind, I think I'll have another beer. Nah, save it for the tanks, my good man. Save it for the tanks. See you guys in Berlin, if you can keep up with the armored force. I will be right there alongside you. I bet you're all feeling pretty silly now that you were scared of just a measly little box of metal with wheels and a couple guns coming out the top. You thought it was an insurmountable force, but no. This man has taught us that a tank is nothing more than an obstacle. Just a mere, a mere uh, speed bump in the highway of life. So the next time a tank challenges you to a 1v1, you can remember the three big rules. Don't run, always have beer, and subscribe.